Hey there. Hey. Hope you like the food. Oh, it's... it's great. Thank you. Peaches and beans. Great for nutrition. Not too great on the way out, though, I tell ya. <laughs> so, it's Luke and Nick. Luke and Nick. You guys sure do look like a match. What's that supposed to mean? I'm just saying you look like good friends, that's all. So, what was your plan here? Hold out for the winter? Actually, we were thinking of moving on. Somewhere up north. You ever heard of a place called Wellington? Wellington? The hell is that? A place. Yeah. Krista and I were going there. Supposed to be a big camp up near Michigan. Michigan? You got a hearing problem, kid? Yeah, Michigan. Think about it. Fresh water, lots of land, and cold-ass winter so the walkers get slow. Sounds like bullshit. Listen, Vanilla Ice. I don't know what your deal is, but you're more than welcome to take off in the morning. That'd be just fine by me. What's the deal with these guys, Clem? Hey, fuck you, buddy. It's fine, Nick. We're not staying. She's staying? What? Excuse me? Please, don't fight. Gentlemen, please. There's no need for this. Now look, we've all had a long day. Please eat. Trying to stay impartial. I am Sweden. Ask me that can, duck. <gasps> oh. Duck? Who's duck? Leave him alone, Luke. Hey, Clementine, would you uh lend me a hand outside for a moment? Uh, I'm sorry about that. You know, I used to be a teacher, and I remember what it's like to be caught in the middle of two clicks. I suspect they'll find common ground soon enough. It may take a little time, but that's just how these things work. Everything will be fine. No, it's not. It's Listen, not Listen, relationships be fine. are like any machine. You don't throw them out when they break down. Everything will not be fine. <sighs> Do you really think everyone can just... Get along. They say the world is over, but I'll tell you a secret. It's not. People are more political now than they ever were before. In the end, we can't change the world. All we can do is continue to learn from each other, to empathize and use our heads. All war is a symptom of man's failure as a thinking animal. Steinbeck, have you read him? Well, we have plenty of time to catch you up on your reading. My partner Matthew is amassing quite the literature collection. I think you'll like him. In any case, the point is, as long as we have our wits about us, we can always make the right choice. Right? It's never that easy. What's the matter, Clementine? Is there something you want to tell me? You can talk to me, Clem. There's almost nothing you could tell me that would surprise me. I can promise you that. I'm worried about your friend. I think that- Don't worry. Matthew will be back soon. And everything will be fine. But I think- Hey kids, what are you two talking about? Oh, politics. The hell? Well, being from Florida, I would imagine you know all about politics, Kenny. Man, I know one advantage of living in the apocalypse is not dealing with that shit no more. I was just gonna check the windows round back before this storm hits. Give us a hand? Sure. No one's letting me talk. Oh! I know you. Miss? Please, do you have any food? Are you okay? I saw the house and I have a family. We're starving. We live down there. Uh, of course. Why don't you come in, Miss... Bonnie. Walt, I don't know. You're just gonna let her in like that? It's fine, Kenny. We don't know this girl. Then we'll have to get to know her. Right, Clem? Walt. How much damage can this poor woman do? Check her for weapons. Yeah. 
Thank you. Really, but that storm will be on us soon, and I gotta get back to my family. I'll bring something out to you then. You don't have to do that. No, no, it's fine. What about your people? We've got plenty. You stay put. I'll be right back. It's trap. I have a little girl like you. How old are you, sweetie? I'm 11. I would have thought older than that. Here you are, miss. This is too much. Don't mention it. I don't know how to thank you. Just help someone else down the line. Thank you so much. I'll be going now. You stay safe. You too. Clem, go on inside and get to bed. Walt and I gotta talk for a second. Giving away all our food. Need that to live. Literally, <laughs> need that to live. Clementine, don't freak out. Listen, okay, I gotta tell you something. That guy on the bridge was Walter's friend. Ah, uh, shit. See, I knew something was off, so I asked Sarita about their friend. Now they're all worried he's not back yet. I know he was, for sure. Damn it. Damn it, Nick. I don't think Walter knows yet. So we have to keep this quiet. I mean, who knows what the hell he'd do if he found out. Well, we should tell him. He's gonna ask who did it, and you're gonna tell him. It's the right thing to do. It's right to get Nick killed because that's what's gonna happen. Now, do you, uh, you still have that knife? Because if it was Matthews and Walter sees it, he's gonna put two and two together. It's with the other weapons. Okay, well, go get rid of it. I'll find Walter and run interference. Oh, and uh, keep an eye out for Nick. I'm right here. What's up? Oh, uh, there's nothing, man. I just wanted to check and see if you're okay. We have to tell you something. Hey, if there's something going on, I want to know. No, just go back to bed, Nick. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. God damn it. Hey, Nick, shut the fuck up. I can't, man. I can't. Do not fucking blow it. Blow it? It's over. I have to tell him, Luke. What? No, you can Hey, Nick, you cannot do that. Are you fucking nuts? I gotta. I can't live with that on me. Okay, I hear you, but f I mean, fuck, man. Do you know what he's gonna do? You don't know he'll do anything. Well, are you kidding me? Nick, you shot his friend. I gotta do this. Jesus, I can't handle this. Look, Clem, just go do that thing, all right? Hide the evidence. Oh shit, it's gone. It's gone. It's gone, it's gone, it's gone. He knows. Oh <laughs> god no. Are you okay? I always like this knife. Gave it to Matthew when all this started. I know he's dead. Who did it? Was it that, that kid? What's his name? Uh Nick? Heard him talking earlier, something about shooting a man. I could see it. I could see it on his face. 
wasn't sure then, but now... It was us. It was our fault. Jesus. I, um... Uh, I don't feel good. Nick shot him. Tell him it was an accident. Is, uh, is Nick a good man? Or is he just like everyone else? He is. He's a good guy, Walter. Oh, no. He was always going out alone. I told him something like this would happen, but he wouldn't listen. No, Matt always knew best. What's going on? You need to tell him. Tell him what? What happened on the bridge. Don't be a pussy, man up. Tell me what you did. Just tell me, son. Tell me what happened. From a distance, it looked like anyone. I, 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 thought, I thought he was going to shoot my friends. And I I shot Matthew. But, but, but it happened real fast. I didn't, I didn't know if I hit him, but I did. And I didn't mean to. Do you know what you've done to me? Do you have any idea? I didn't mean to. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Walter. Put down the knife. the guns. Guns? That thing's a damn dinner bell. What the hell was that? Damn it. Transformer must have gone. Gotta check it. I could use a hand. I'll go with you. I'm going to. No! It's too dangerous. The rest of you, get this thing shut down. Does anyone know how to do this? Cut all the wires. I can do it. Okay. We'll watch your back. Nick, scan the trees with me. Let's put on the engineer hat. Why well, I only have one hat. Key. In the hole. Just like your first time. A lot smoother than my first time. <laughs> 